hello friends welcome back to my channel god bless you so much for stopping by again today to hear what the lord would have us know my name is sharon welcome and thank you for all of the ways that you do support this channel i am very grateful god bless you in jesus name today i have this word for you someone who has all the credentials all the quality lovely credentials uh, but there is a but there is a but Every single one of us in life, of course, you know, have that time seasons in our lives where everything is rosy, everything is rosy, but there is just this one little corner in your life that you would wish is not there. You would wish you don't have. Yes, every one of us at some point, but in various degrees. So yours may not be as pronounced or you haven't really taken note of it. But um, today, word is coming for every but in our lives. This Bible verse came to mind when this word came today. Tell my people I am removing the bots, that thing that is sitting in your life somewhere that you are telling the Lord, take away, take away, take away. You know, it's just there. Though you have all other things in place, though you have all other things going for you, but there is something. Is it a child that is, you know, behaving in a certain manner and you are not proud to present them when... In the midst of people, you are not proud to bring them forth as your child or introduce them as your child. Yes, it can happen. It happens a lot of times. The enemy did it. The Bible made us understand that the enemy did it. The enemy sowed tears. You tried your best to bring them up in a certain way or the way of the Lord, but they turned out the way they did, and that is the bot in your life. Or for whatever reason, you are just doing good in every other aspect, but there is a health challenge that you can't tell anybody of. There is a health challenge that is bothering you. There is that thing in your body that when you want to take certain steps it hinders you it stops you yes that could be your own butt and for some other persons anything it can be anything you know your life you know how it has been for you and those butts in some ways hinder you in some ways they stop you in some ways they are not pleasant to hear or it's not a pleasant topic to discuss with people. You are that person I have come for today. And by the mercies of God, I bring your butt before the throne of grace today. And I ask that the Lord, by his mercy, by his mighty, gracious arm, will take it away from you, will pull it away from its foundation. Wherever that butt found its way into your life, my father, my maker, let it be blotted out right now by the blood of Jesus. It was said of Naaman in, in the book of Second Kings chapter 5, Verse 1, now Naaman, captain of the host of the king of Syria, was a great man with his master and honorable because by him the Lord has given deliverance unto Syria. He was also a mighty man in valor. The conclusion of it is that, but he was a leper. You see the CV, you see the accolades that he has, but he was a leper. That bot in your life today, child of God, comes to an end in the name of Jesus. There is nothing impossible with your God. There is no impossibility with your Father. I stand in agreement with you, including for myself. I'm making that prayer for myself as well. Any bot that is not glorifying the name of God in our lives is hereby subdued in the name of Jesus and destroyed out of our lives in the name of Jesus. I decree and I declare whatever represents a bot that is in your life and it is hindering the full potential of Christ from manifesting in you. Right now, that bot is hereby removed. It is hereby aborted. It is hereby terminated. It is hereby destroyed. Out of your life. Out of the life of my brother listening to me. Out of the life of my sister watching this video right now. In the name of Jesus. Any bot whatsoever, wherever it came from, it is written that the hand of the Lord uh, is not too short to deliver. By the hand of the Most High right now, I decree from its source, its root, uh, that bot that is sitting in your life, that will not let you go. That will not let you have peace of mind. That will not let you excel beyond a certain level. It comes to an end right now. It comes to an end right now. Receive your liberty. Receive your deliverance. Receive your freedom in the name of Jesus. This is someone's word today, including mine. Yes, I need it. I need it. I need it. <laughs> in the name of Jesus, I receive my deliverance. I receive my total turnaround and I pray that you will not miss yours in Jesus' mighty name. You will sing a new song. We shall sing a new song in the mighty name of Jesus. God bless you, friends. I'll see you again in my next video. Bye-bye.